So I was just sniffing around YouTube, searching around, I don't know. I was sniffing for good content. I got a nose for content. I was just looking around YouTube for fun One Piece material to react to and I stumbled upon this Would You Rather series and I was like, hey, I'm a One Piece voice actor. I'm the current voice of Scratch from Napu, rest in peace, Brad Venable. It seems like fun. Let's just get into the video, huh? Whatever you agree with, whatever you disagree with, feel free to comment below, let's go. All right, let's hop into the video. Would you rather? Yes, I would rather. Oh yeah. Would you rather be in Buggy's pirate crew or be in Blackbeard's pirate crew? Easy, Buggy. Blackbeard's pirate crew is filled, like look at these guys. Look at their faces. Every one of these guys looks like they're gonna betray you. Ah, ah. Sure, Buggy looks a little evil. He's a Yonko, you know, he's doing his thing. Do your thing, 21, do your thing. Would you rather meet Whitebeard or meet Gold D. Roger? Roger, easy. The Pirate King. It's like, would you rather meet the president or the vice president? <laughs> would you rather save Robin's home from the Buster Call or save Nami's home from Arlong? Nami's home is already saved by Arlong. Robin's home is not saved by, so if I could go back in time, I'd save Robin's home from the Buster Call. I mean, what a tragic story. And all of that could have been avoided. Like, honestly, she would probably never join the crew, but like, what's gonna do the most good? Ohara was super necessary, so like, if that place was still around probably good for everyone right switch bodies with zoro switch bodies with sanji for a day i'd rather switch bodies with zoro big zoro fan i'd like to see what it's like to be a badass be able to pick everything up fight with a sword in my mouth would you rather bring whitebeard back to life or bring ace back to life oh ace he just he's a younger guy he you know whitebeard got to achieve everything he wanted and more ace you know, he had ambitions, he had things he wanted to do. That's what made it so tragic, Ace. Would you rather tell Zoro we ran out of sake or booze, have to tell Nami we lost all the berries? Zoro, easy. I mean, dude, Nami would straight up kill your ass. She'd murk you. Zoro would be angry, but he wouldn't kill you. Would you rather be Doflamingo's height, 10 feet, or two feet, 11 and a half inches? Uh, Doflamingo. I, you imagine how good I'd be at basketball? Come on, man! That's too easy! how stellar, what YouTube content I could make. I wouldn't even have to make anime content. I could just be like, every video I do would be 10 foot man does blank. And I just do, go do stuff and people be like 10 foot? There's a 10 foot man? Yeah, it's me. I'd be a YouTube gazillion. Hey, I hope you're enjoying this would you rather quiz. You know what I would rather? You subscribe. <laughs> Back to the video. Would you rather control your hockey perfectly, eat a random devil fruit? Hockey, it all comes down to the hockey. If it's a random devil fruit, I don't even know. What if I eat the poop poop fruit and I'm just a poop man? <laughs> Would you rather have an all you can eat buffet, have one meal made for you by Sanji? Sanji meal. I'd want a Sanji meal. I could just go to Vegas, get an all-you-can-eat buffet. I could I could go down the street. Get a, they don't even tell you what kind of all-you-can-eat buffet. I'd rather... I want to taste what Sanji's cooking. I want him to, to pet me while he asks me if I like it. Be part of CP9 or work under Crocodile? Uh, CP9. If I'm a part of CP9, that implies that I'm a huge badass. There's a bunch of weak people who work under Crocodile who then got like double crossed, like crocodiles out here being sketchy, you know? Would you rather train under Mihawk for two years, train under Rayleigh for two years, Rayleigh? Easy. Mihawk, I don't think, if I was in the world of One Piece, I don't think I'd want to be a swordsman. I just think that there'd be so many, I'd want to figure out what my thing is, you know? I don't have a backstory where my sparring partner and somebody that I cared about deeply was a swords person and now I want to be the best. I, I don't have that backstory. I want to figure it out. And Rayleigh's the man to help me figure it out. Would you rather laugh like Gecko Moria? <laughs> I can't remember how he does it. <laughs> or the uh, the k she she she's shoot all those that's i mean it's cute for a minute but it gets it's gonna piss people off after a while would you rather eat a log have corazon's clumsiness or have zoro sense of direction nia devil fruit wait what okay would i rather eat a fruit and have corazon's clumsiness or would i rather have zoro's sense of direction zoro's sense of direction easy if you're clumsy you just be breaking stuff you know if i just 
don't have direction, I can use Google Maps. Would you rather be part of the Don Quixote family or the Whitebeard Pirates? Uh, Whitebeard Pirates. Not even close. This is a man who's all about family. He wants to take care. So if I'm already a part, I'm family, man. And he'll do anything for family. Don Quixote family, they're not gonna... They're, 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 would you rather be a celestial dragon or be a, I, I, my voice cracked, or be a straw hat pirate? What? What? I'm here for the adventure. I'm not here to be sitting on my butt being a, a billionaire. I want to be in the action. Would you rather have Monkey D. Dragon as your father or have Gold D. Roger as your father? I mean, neither. <laughs> They're both just like dads who weren't around for their kids. Which would I, which parent who is not around ever would you rather have as your dad? Which dad that leaves and you never know would you rather have neither? I guess Monkey D Dragon, because then it's not like you. Because if you're if you're the son of Gold D Roger, you're like always gonna be in his shadow. You know, Ace climbed out of it because he was that incredible, but he's still in the shadow. As soon as people find out, it's like, oh, he's. He's just Goldie Rogers kid, you know? It's like you'd be in the shadow. Would you rather spend the rest of your life with Jinbei? Spend the rest of your life with Bartholomew Kuma. Jinbei. He seems like a nice, honorable dude. But Kuma, we don't know hardly anything about. I don't even know this guy. Is he cool? Yeah. Could he transport me places with his paws? Sure. But Jinbei's like, uh, I don't know. Would you rather have curly eyes, eyes like Sanji, have a long nose like Usopp? Dude, <laughs> eyebrows. Eyebrows for sure. Can you imagine if you had a nose that long? What people, <laughs> that'd be unnatural. You'd be walking down the street, kid, children would like their ice cream would fall off of their cone, they'd be pointing at you. Would you rather have Marco's mythical Zoan or have X Drake's ancient Zoan? Oh, dude, Marco's Zoan? Yeah, I'd rather be a phoenix. I wanna be a myth. I don't wanna be something old. Would you rather be an admiral or be a Yonko? Yonko, easy. Would you rather have an intense workout with Zoro or have a long history lesson from Robin? Oh, both sound really painful. A history lesson, I wanna know. I wanna, if I'm dropped in the world of One Piece, I wanna know what's going on. Would you rather be able to fire Frankie's radical beam, be able to have seven transformations like Chopper? Ooh, this is genuinely, I need a second. A few moments later. Day two. Because the radical beam would be powerful, but I feel like everyday life, it would be cooler to have seven transformations. And it's like, oh, this is my transformation where I'm really tall and I can pick stuff off the fridge. <laughs> would you rather be able to change your hairstyle like Frankie, be able to cook like Sanji? Sanji! So oh, but I would love to have hair. <laughs> This question's like specifically for bald people. Uh, Sanji, I'd rather cook. Would you rather be able to read poneglyphs or be able to navigate through the seas? Well, the thing is, being able to read poneglyphs is very specific, and it makes you an enemy of the world. So I'd, I'd rather be able to na navigate the seas. It's like too much knowledge is too much power sometimes. Would you rather live in Dressrosa or live in Thriller Bark? Dress Rosa, especially before or after Do Flamingo gets there. Dress Rosa for sure. Thriller Bark just looks all dark and scary. There's a bunch of uh, yeah. Dress Rosa. Thank you so much. Forever bright fun tests and quizzes. This was fun. If you enjoyed this video and you want to watch me actually test my knowledge of how much I know about One Piece, click on this video here. Please subscribe down below and comment how you would have answered differently than me. All right. Thanks everybody. Bye.